Hello everybody and welcome to Romanceville's Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a general reading so it will not resonate with everybody although I have narrowed it down. This one here is going to be for the sign of Virgo. Um, so this reading here is with the title of um, it's a love triangle, so third party. Does he or she love me or them? So we're going to find that out just in a little moment. Just want to say, if ever you do have any questions after this reading, you can reach me if you would like to have a private reading at romancefultarot at gmail.com. And I will provide you with all of that information. Also, if you do like my videos, um, you can leave a donation. The link is in the Dropbox um, video also at the end of this video in the box and um, also one last very thing if you do enjoy my videos please do subscribe it's my only way really of knowing that you enjoyed my video and that you want to have more of my videos and you want to have more of my messages so please do subscribe like share send me some comments I'd love to read your comments so that being said let's go see what's going on so up here, I rem I'm going to remind you, this is your line, so the Quarence line, and this is a third party over here. All right. So for you, we have the Queen of Wands, we have the Ace of Wands, and we have the Lovers. Well, the Queen of Wands, well, she is she is impatient and everything, but she is temperament. She is confident. She's a helper. She's intuitive. You know, she's got intuition. She's charming. She's experienced, but she is very temperamental. So, you know, I, I do see that there is a lot of character into this relationship up here. Following it up over here, although we do know that there is a third party here hanging around, lurking around, there is new beginnings that are going to come. There is going to be a flame that is going to renew itself. There's going to be a new beginnings. There's going to be communications. There's going to be a new path that's going to be taken. Now, will this path be taken together? Yes, it will be because you have the lovers that is following that is ending. You could not have a better card at the end of this type of question. So, do they love you? Yes, they do. Nonetheless, uh, although all of these problems here, you are going to rekindle, you are going to ignite the flame again, and you know, um, you will continue on the path together. As for the uh, third person here, uh, what's going on over there? Well, uh, there's a lot of strength here. This person is trying to hold on to uh, to your partner. They do not want to let go. Um, they have been told many things. They've been promised many things that they could have whatever they wanted, whenever they wanted, and that everything was possible. They had all the realm of possibilities of family and children and long-term relationship and whatever you could want in the in a relationship. This was promised to them they um so they they're holding on this is what they want this is what they want to have but um they're finding out here that this is just not what's going to happen all the work that has been done into this relationship is not giving the results um that are expected so this relationship here is going to end um so this ends for the question does he or she love me or them question here querent yes here, third party, no, it will end. Um, false promises, uh, nothing good, and there is love up here, there's promise up here. The partner wants to continue in this relationship up here with you. So I hope I was able to bring you some clarity. I hope you enjoyed my uh, my message. Um, I do wish you a wonderful day. Please do not forget to subscribe to show me your love and to show me your support to my channel. And if you want, you can also leave um, some uh, donation. The link is in the box at the end of this video. So please do have a great day and um, we will see each other tomorrow for a daily snapshot. Thank you so much for being there.